So guys, um, AirDrop, Universal Control, all these things, living in the Apple ecosystem is just fantastic. It's so convenient. Those of you that have multiple Apple devices know what I'm talking about. And I know Android, you got a lot of freedom. Windows has a lot of productivity going on, you know, with their office suites and whatnot. But there is no doubt in that Apple has the ecosystem down pack. Now it's not all perfect though. So that's why I'm making this video today. I was gonna show you whenever you have trouble connecting between two devices wirelessly, whether it's to extend a uh, display or to use the universal control, um, new feature that is in the latest iPad, as well as with the latest Mac OS, those supported devices. I believe they're all the M1 Max that have the, the latest chip will support all those new features. But sometimes like mirroring your screen from the iPad to your Mac mini, it doesn't work as, as well as smooth. So I'm gonna show you a couple troubleshooting steps that you could do to alleviate the problem and fix it right away. So let's just get started. Uh, first thing I'm gonna show you stream or watch something, some media up on your big screen on the Mac mini but it's just not working. Whenever you try to go to the screen mirroring, it doesn't show up. It doesn't find my Mac mini, even though we're in the same network. Actually, it's even connected through the USB-C port, but it's not seeing it. So the quick way to fix this is actually quite simple. You have to head over to the Mac mini. So I have my system preference open right here and then head over to sharing. You're gonna have the little folder there head over to share and down at the bottom, you're gonna see AirPlay receiver. Uncheck it, turn it off, turn it back on. That's it, it's that simple. Now let's head over to the iPad, see if we can find the Mac mini. And it's not showing up. Okay. All right, so I guess we got to troubleshoot some more. Go figure, after a couple of tries doing the same thing, just turning off the AirPlay receiver off and on, it wouldn't work. I have no idea why, but I rebooted the iPad and the Mac mini once more, just restarted it like a normal reboot and it's working. So, I know I've sometimes rebooted before and it wouldn't work. So definitely the just resetting the whole system, whether it's with, with a reboot or just turning off AirPlay receiver, whatever it is, it's working now. Now we could head over to our screen mirroring and there it is. Uh, I'm unable to connect with the Mac mini probably because I'm recording the screen both in my Mac mini as well as in my iPad. So but now we can see the Mac mini. So it's pretty cool. There it is. All right, guys. So if this video was helpful to you guys, um, I will appreciate a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.